News 5 investigates damage from barges during Hurricane Sally. 22 barges from the construction group Skanska broke loose near the Pensacola Bay Bridge and all ended up along Pensacola Bay. One hitting the bridge, causing major damage that could take months to repair. WKRG.com mobile journalist Daniel Smithson tells us how the barges are now affecting homeowners. Residents along Pensacola Bay believe Skanska was negligent and think they have a lot of explaining to do. This massive construction barge sits on land nuzzled between two homes off Bayshore Drive in Pensacola. Before it came to a stop, the barge hit this home down the street, damaging the seawall, a dock, and possibly causing foundation issues. Terrifying to see it. We have no idea if it has compromised the structure of the house. An unreal experience for homeowner Miriam Breeden. I felt like transported to somewhere else because it's not in my wildest dream, I would expect to see a massive barge parked in my house. Breeden's home was not the only home affected by this barge. This home suffered damage too. Another barge stayed away from homes a mile away on Bayshore Lane. Homeowners relieved to be spared. And it just shows the power of nature and how awesome nature is and what it can do to something as large as that barge. Skanska says the company did all it could to secure the barges before the storm hit. It says it remains dedicated to retrieving all of the barges and getting life back to normal for residents. Breeden says she hopes Skanska is held accountable. I would like for them to come and tell me that they are sorry, that everything is going to be okay, that they are going to fix it, that they are going to do the right thing. I think they have to be responsible for it. They have to pay for what they have done. Now, the Love and Papantonio law firm here in Pensacola plans to file several individual lawsuits against Skanska soon. Reporting in Pensacola, I'm Daniel Spitzen, WKRG News 5.